What's up, Raf gang? It's Raf. Raf Cave. Welcome back to another unboxing video. All right, guys. Well, I am uh, going to be starting to tweak my home theater. Now, I'm not talking about Odyssey with the little puck that comes with the receiver. I'm talking seriously dial in multiple subwoofers and find out where are the best locations as well as match the subwoofers as close as possible also making sure all my seats have good bass response and you're not able to do that with just one single mic in the receiver taking measurements of your room it, it tries to balance things out but it's not going to give you the right the right uh, configuration for your bass to sound great everywhere in your in your seating area so and also a lot of times with odyssey it's going to actually drop power from one sub to compensate for another sub so they're all fighting each other and all this stuff so it's a, it's a whole mess of worlds now I've, done, I've been watching a lot of videos around youtube um youth man and uh yeah everyone's got their own philosophy and stuff so i'm just trying to look at the simplest video out there to help me get through this and i have some other raft gang vips that can help me out as well you know who you are, Sammy. All right, so with that being said, guys, if you really want to get your system to sound its best with your subwoofers, you're going to need one of these bad boys. This guy here, UMI K1, holy cow. This microphone will be able to give you readings that no other microphone in receivers and processors can give you. So let me show you guys the website. So UMI K1 run mini DSP's website, 75 bucks. This mic is going to give you so much more flexibility in tweaking and getting your subs crossovers, getting your subs uh, decibel levels, getting the locations just right. So definitely look into it, guys. Now, when you buy this mic, there's a serial serial number on it, and you scroll down and put that serial number here, and you're able to get the calibration file that uh, REW, right? <laughs> REW, Room Acoustic Software, this and this mic work in hand in hand, so you can see charts. You'll see all these charts here. So say for, you know, right here, right on my mouse right here, you see these little dips here, right? That's that's not what we want for our subwoofers, right? We want to get a nice, you know, smooth line, as, as smooth as possible. See these lines here? And, and that way you get the smoothest bass response in your theater, and also multiple seats will get the same, close to the same uh, bass, uh, that everyone else is experiencing. So one seat's not going to be like a dead zone where the other seats are going to be great. You know, that dead zone, we want to help that one, right? So lots to go into this, guys. This is just an unboxing. I'm going to try to get, you know, through this stuff. I don't know if I'll make videos, but maybe I'll make a video and show what I'm doing. Uh, but it's a whole nother experience. And uh, yeah, I'll be getting into my home theater a lot more and making some videos. Uh, but yeah, so with this mic, with the Rev software and some other software as well, I hear. Um, you're gonna, and of course, right? This is just the mic. We still need the Mini DSP. Let's go back to the Mini DSP's website and uh, products. We want to look at this guy here. This is another unboxing that I'll do on Friday. Mini DSP is what you plug your subwoofers into, and that is able to to uh, change crossovers, change phases. You can tune your subs together. That's a whole other thing. So we'll talk about that later. Um, but yeah, that's that's going to be hooked up as well. So it's a whole family of things to get your system working. So without further ado, guys, let's get back into the unboxing. And I'll show you what this thing looks like inside. All right, guys. Let me flip my screen over here. Okay. So here's the box. Mini DSP, right? Measurement microphone. Boom. Back of the box, guys. Technical specs. Get my face out of there. There we go. Boom. Boom. 
Slide this open. Oh my. It's got some heft to it. So you get a, uh, a windscreen. Hey, how you doing? A windscreen. Little salt salt pellets or whatever on top of there. There's the power condenser right there. And uh, yeah, mini DSP. And you have a, uh, is that USB-C? Nice. Right in the bottom there. Where's that? Is that windscreen? And boom. Just like that. And when you're calibrating, you want to point it upward. Right? And you also get a little tripod in here. Nice little foam insert. So this right here is going to be your clamp for the mic. Boom, like that. And we're going to want to keep it on a tripod like this. It looks like you got a nice little mini tripod here. Screw on the bottom. That matches up right there but you also want to get a larger tripod if you want to you know put a little higher or whatnot and then you get the usb usb c to usb right so this will go into your laptop or computer preferably a laptop where you'll download the rev software and uh the mini dsp software and then this will all work together and then you can start seeing the graphs and seeing where your your subwoofers are at so this is step one. Got to have this, guys. So, um, yeah, man, I've never calibrated my audio the system like this. And this is a whole nother ball of wax here that does so much wonders that I'm seeing uh, to your subwoofers and getting rid of uh, peaks and nulls in your room and make sure all your seats are great. So I'm excited to get more juice out of my subs and to tweak my future sub as well. All right, guys, thanks for watching this video. Uh, Mini DSP is in the raft cave, so we'll just keep uh, keep this train going. But I'll see you in the next videos, all right? Home theater rules. Raff out. See you guys.